What's up, guys? Mr. Schwo here, and uh, I guess we're going to jump right into the action on this gameplay. You know, <laughs> I don't know, must have been late on the recording or something, but anyway. Uh, this is Yeah, this is a CTL from the beta on checkout, but uh, I need you guys' help. So I'm going to be doing a live commentary for my first match on Gears of War 3. No matter how bad I do, I will upload it. And uh, I need to know what weapons I should start with, like like what should be my starting loadout, like assault rifle and shotgun. Should I use uh, for assault rifle? Should I go with the powerful up close, uh, not so good from far away, retro charging, uh, retro lancer? Should I go with the uh, the iron sighted hammer burst with its uh, semi automatic firing and somewhat high bullet damage? Although apparently it's been nerfed. Or should I go with the uh, the old favorite, the regular Lancer, with its 60-round clip, manageable recoil, and chainsaw, one-hit kill bayonet? It's a, it's a tough decision. I'm not sure what I should do. And uh, I figured I'd leave it up to you guys. And uh, shotguns, should I go with the 8-shell, uh, uh, decent-range Nasher, or the one-shot, only good, right up in your face, sawed off? Uh, you know, I'd, I felt like it should uh, be up to you guys, since this channel is about... It's about gears, not about me. It's about what people want to see. Well, it's not all about gears, actually. Uh, I'm going to start posting some Modern Warfare 3 when that comes out. I'll be posting Gears 3 daily still, but I just hope that doesn't bother everybody too much. I just, I can't tie myself to one game or one game franchise. That just seems a little silly to me. Like, there's a lot of great games out there, all kinds of stuff, shooters, you know, whatever. And uh, I don't want to just, you know, I, mean, I love Gears. Gears is the best. I, I, you know, I always defend Gears up and down. Gears is better than Call of Duty. Gears is better than Battlefield. Gears is better than Halo. Gears is better than Mario. Gears is better than Sonic the Hedgehog. Gears is better than Tetris. But still, I just can't play only one game. Sorry. I just don't want gaming to be, like, that's what happened with the Call of Duty community. They made it all about Call of Duty, and then it wasn't cool to post anything else. And I just don't, I don't want to see that happen with any game. Everyone should be able to post whatever they want without hate. And uh, we should all hold hands and be happy. But, uh, but yeah, I, uh, I I don't know what I want to do for the starting weapons. I'm not even sure myself. So, uh, like I said, I'll leave it up to you guys. And uh, we'll see what happens. I mean, uh, today's Tuesday, September 6th, which means in two weeks from today, it'll be September 20th, and we'll be playing Gears 3. That's pretty exciting because uh, I got to tell you, I'm just bored with everything that's out right now. I can't play Gears 2. I can't play Black Ops. It just they all just frustrate me. It just this is time to time to get something new. We're just two weeks away, and that's awesome. So I'm running out of stuff to talk about here. Let's see what's going on in the gameplay. Uh, looks like I had the leader, and, or I went out. Looks like I was captured and got saved. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Uh, whenever I play as the leader, I just run right in and get down like a million times. I I guess it's that whole not being able to die thing. It's like I'll just I just run in. I kind of hurt my team a lot. I noticed this during a lot of my gameplays. I'll just be running in, and getting slapped. Man, I miss this map. This is one of the all-time great Gears maps, and we only got to play it for like a month that we were able to tell. It's just uh, I don't know. It's not even really that small of a map. It just everything's so tight. It just feels like it's really close quarters. I believe it was actually technically the second biggest map in the beta, but anyway. So yeah, I just wanted to check in with you guys. I know I don't have the biggest fan base in the world, but there are some of you out there that comment on, look at that bounce. That is some Gears 1 bounce action right there. Damn. But yeah, I know that there are a bunch of you out there that always watch, always rate, and always comment, so I wanted to let you guys decide what I should use. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm good with all five of the weapons. I'm not one of those people that, you know, if you've listened to any of my commentaries, you know I'm not one of those people that thinks it's a newbie to use the retro or the sawed-off. They all they all offer different uh, degrees of fun, and that's what it's all about. It's about having fun. Gaming's about having fun. It's not about always using the best setups and stuff like that. You got you to gotta mix it up. You got to keep it enjoyable. That's, how, that's why people get bored. They do the same thing over and over. People get bored of Call of Duty. Well, stop running the FAMAS and Ghost every game. You know, I guess you could make the case for Gears 2, maybe try using the Hammer Burst, but uh, I don't know. I just don't like the Hammer Burst in Gears 2. It just doesn't, something just doesn't feel right about it. Man, uh, I miss Capture the Leader. You could just, like, you could just bang out a game in, like, two seconds. 
And if you get leader, you could expect to hold a pretty high KD. I don't know if they're going to keep it the way it is, like like it was in the beta. Like if the highest rank always got leader, then it will go to the next highest rank, the next round or whatever. Because if they do, and I'm gonna be playing this game a lot, so I'm gonna be ranked pretty high. I'm gonna have a monster KD in this game type. Like in the beta, I had a 5.1. I want to see if I can get that up to like seven or eight. But uh, you know, not the kill death ratio is an important stat. It is nothing is for nothing else but uh, aesthetic purposes. It does not show any skill. It's all about the win loss. As I make some really, really bad shots with a Nasher right there. Yikes. That was pretty terrible. Got no uh no defense for that one. We're almost done here. Looks like we're about to wrap this up. Pick up there it is that Gorgon again. Remember, pick that thing up. It's a beast. But yeah, I just wanted to just wanted to throw that out there. Hopefully people will comment. Uh, I'll let it. I'll let that run down until we're about five days away from Gears Three. Then I'll uh, I'll announce what I'll be using, and we'll be good to go. And this gameplay is wrapping up. So you guys, tell me what you want to see me uh, play my first game with. Leave a nice little comment, and I'll uh, see you guys later.